What is going on, people? Today is day number 21 of the 31 Days Hath October series, which I'm doing on this channel. For those of you who have not checked out the 20 other uh, reviews that I've done, go ahead and do that after this one, of course. Uh, but for those of you who don't know what 31 Days Hath October is, it's my series where I do 31 horror movie reviews in 31 days. A whole bunch of people are doing it, calling it a little bit different, 31 Days of Horror, 31 Days of Halloween. I call it 31 Days Half October, and I do it a little bit different. I try to do more independent titles, and I try, try to do them in alphabetical order. Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't, sometimes I have to throw a little curveball and stuff. But, you know, I try to do maybe movies that some people might not have heard of before, because, of course, everybody likes watching horror movies during the month of October, and sometimes people are looking for something new to watch. So, within the past couple of years that I've done this, you know... You'll, you'll probably hear some movies that you never heard of before. A whole bunch of people are doing it. 13th Wolfman. Uh, Jonathan Moody's doing some kind of indie films as well at IndieFilmCafe.com. Uh, at Indie Film Cafe on, here on YouTube. A whole bunch of people are doing it. I'll leave the links to their channels in the description so you can check out their stuff after mine. If you've seen my movies or maybe the movies that I review, you might not want to check out. Check out everybody else's channel because you're bound to find a movie to watch. Uh, before I get into today's review, if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button. If you enjoy this review, go ahead and hit that thumbs up button. Hit that bell button. Technically, don't have to do it this month because I'm going to be doing a review every day. But after this month, you know, when I might take a few days off and it's not as frequent, hit the bell button so you know when I do upload more stuff. Uh, you know, comment, you know, socialize throughout these things. It helps out the channel and, you know, and of course share it if you, you know, might know someone who wants to see this movie or, you know, loves horror and is looking for movies to watch. You can go from there. So anyway, today's letter is S and the movie I'm reviewing is... Spookies. This one is put out by Vinegar Syndrome. It has the special edition. I believe this is uh, special edition number two uh, slipcover. The original one looks like this uh, with a, you know, scantily clad woman kind of deal getting pretty much uh, her clothes torn off by all these monsters and all these creepies and ghoulies and all that stuff kind of deal. And, uh, yeah, so this is the special edition uh, cover art for uh, Vinegar Syndrome Spookies. Uh, this one was uh, directed by uh, Jeannie Joseph Thomas Doran and others. It says here on uh, IMDb, it's written by Ann Bergen and Thomas Doran, among others. It stars Felix Ward, uh, Maria Pachukas, hopefully I said that right, probably not, uh, Dan Scott, among others. So pretty much what this movie is about, it's a horror comedy, uh, you know, it's not like, ha ha, well, some scenes, you, you know, you could laugh at and stuff, but pretty much it's about a sorcerer who lives in this house, and pretty much he finds different ways to uh, kind of take the life from people and give it to his uh, his wife, his bride, uh, and to keep her young and beautiful and all this stuff, he pretty much takes people's essence and, and stuff and they um, and he gives it to his wife, like I said. So pretty much what happens in this one, a group of people uh, break down, they, their car breaks down, and they end up go, going to this house. And let's just say this is a house they should not have entered and all this stuff. And... Um, you know, it's one of those things where this guy is a sorcerer, so he has all these different, like I said, creatures and all this stuff. Uh, you know, it's some of the stuff that looks really cool, especially because it is from the 80s. But, you know, back then everything was practical and everything looked that much cooler, I think, back then because everything was made of prosthetic and all that stuff as opposed to, you know, CG and all, the, all these movies now where you can... Certain times, unless it's like really, really good, you can tell it's fake and all that stuff. But back then with the practical effects and whatever, like I said, I'll show you the back cover again. Like uh, the one thing looks pretty cool. Uh, one of the monsters and all this stuff. So pretty much what happens is uh, these group of people are getting kind of taken out one by one by one by this guy and his, his creatures. It is, you know, an 80s, um, you know, 
cheesy cheese fest, I guess you want to call it. But it is pretty, you know, entertaining and such, you know. Uh, at certain points, they all break up, these group. It's uh, pretty much like teenagers and stuff. So, you know, them getting caught and trying to, like, run and all that stuff. It is very entertaining for what it is. Like I said, it is 80s cheese to the max, but it's, it's funny, 80s cheese. So if you haven't seen it, I'd say go ahead and check it out for sure. If you enjoy 80s films, I think this one will definitely be, you know, for you. Uh, for those of you who haven't noticed, my reviews for these have gone a little bit shorter and stuff because by the end of the month, like I said, there's 10 days left. Been doing it for 21 days. It gets a little tiring. Plus, I don't, you know, I don't give too much away in most of my reviews anyway but if you want anything any of the movies i did review review a little bit deeper let me know and i'll definitely go ahead and do it for you but i'll leave all everything that you need to know about this i'll leave the trailer for the movie in the description i'll leave the link to where you can purchase it in the description i'll leave all the other people doing 31 days like i said if you didn't want to see this one you know Check out everybody else. You'll find a movie that you probably will enjoy. And anything you need will be in the description. I'll leave my other social medias. I got a YouTube. YouTube. I got a Twitter. I got a Facebook fan page. I got an Instagram where I show off the movies behind me. Part of the Dorkening. Uh, every Tuesday night, the Wicked Horror Show. So check that out. And uh, yeah, hopefully you enjoyed this review. Like I said, if you have, might have seen this one or you don't want to check this one out, check out all 20 other reviews and of course like i said check out everybody else who's doing this you know challenge this 31 day challenge but yeah so i guess until tomorrow i'll see you guys